So, beer review for today. We are drinking Hophead by Dark Star Brewing. Um, so, I've drunk this one before. I've had this before, but I've run out of um, unique beers at the moment um, until next week. So, this is a 3.8% beer. Um, the taste notes say, an extremely clean drinking pale golden ale with strong floral aroma and elderflower notes from the Cascard hops. This beer is full-bodied and full-flavoured, yet gentle enough to make it a favourite session beer. That sounds cool. That sounds cool. The can's pretty cool. I like the Dark Star thing. It reminds me a bit of David Bowie. David Bowie with his Dark Star stuff. Oh, here we go. Let's get this. I completely forgot where I put my um my bottle opener. Hey, McChairs, how are you doing, my friend? Good to see you. How have you been? How have you been? Hello there. Why did that button not work? Did it work? Did it not work? Oh, it did work. Oh, I'll tell you what's probably happened. I'll probably turn my headphone down. Right, so let's get this poured. Yeah, what have you been up to, McChairs? Let's get this poured in. See all the ASMR sounds going on there. Oh yeah, fizzy hop hoppiness. Okay, it does smell quite hoppy. Like in the local town I live in, they um, there's a big brewery. The town was built up around a brewery, base brewery basically. That's why it exists. It's it's a brewery town, and it's it's a, a halfway stop between London and Dover, pretty much. Hey, Carl and Louise, welcome in, my friend. How are you doing? And cheers to your tea, Sagittarius. Um, yeah, so it was built up around a brewery, and this is how it smells. Every Wednesday or Thursday, it smells like this in the town, which is a nice smell. When I used to live here years ago, I hated the smell. It really annoyed me. Um, then I moved away, and now I've come back, and I can smell it again. I think, like, the memory's sake of it, it brings back some memories. It's like, oh, it's actually a really nice smell now. And um, when I used to live here, I didn't really drink beer. I drank wine more than beer, and now I drink beer. So when I smell it in town, it's like, hmm, that's nice. So yeah, it's a nice smell. It's a really good hoppy, strong hoppy smell. Flavor-wise, it tastes like beer. <laughs> Flavor-wise, um, I'd say it's... It is quite... Once again, it's quite a hoppy taste. Like, has anybody ever eaten, like, hops? Has anybody ever eaten hops? The local brewery. Oh, i tell you what it tastes like. I'm trying to figure the name of it. There's a beer I had in Belgium, in Br uh, Belgium, yeah, in Belgium, in Bruges. A beer I had in Bruges. Um, it began with a G, and there was only one bar that makes it. It's like you drink it at the bar that makes it, and it became with a G. Let's see if I can Google it quickly, and it tastes like that. Um, Bruges beer, beginning with G, beginning with G. Let's see if something comes up for that. Uh, do, 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 do. No, no. None of them. 37 beers not to, not to miss. Okay, maybe this is it. Belgian beers. No, no, no. Oh, I don't think we're going to find it. I don't think we're going to find it. But, Gunnardale. Gunnardale. No, it's not that, I don't think. That doesn't ring a bell as being the one I'm thinking of. I'll find it. You know what? I'll find a photograph of straight off the stream. I bet you a photograph appears on my phone. Because my phone's always listening. <laughs> My phone's always listening, so I bet you a photograph turns up on my timeline straight after. Anyway, so I quite like this. It smells nice, it tastes nice, so I'm enjoying it. Um, and it's not too strong, so they're right. It's a sessionable one. You could probably sit and drink this all night long. Probably have it with something... Um... I'd drink it with anything, any food, like a nice fish dish or like a, um, a steak meal or something like that. I think it would go with anything. You know, it's not because it's sessionable. It's not overly intrusive flavour. It's kind of cool. I think I'll go with everything. So I'm going to give this a strong, a very strong four. Very strong four. So cheers, everyone.